In this video, I'm going to show you the locations of all the lost balls on the Seagull Stacks course of Walkabout Mini Golf. If you'd like to see what the balls look like, skip to the end of the video to see a complete like little picture. For hole number one, the ball can be found immediately as you go straight past the hole, past this little current stones thing, and you'll see the ball there is there by the wall, just like this. For hole number two, if you look at this pillar immediately on your right, the ball is right behind it on the floor behind the bush there. You can see there it is. This is what it looks like. For hole number three, we're going to progress along this path over here. So just go ahead and follow me past these two rock things, the one in the middle on the course and the one on the right, and go behind the one on the right. And you can see down there on that rock is where the ball is with the little hearts on it. For hole number four, you're going to go across this bridge and immediately to the left, you'll see there is a loose stone that is on the ground over here. Just behind the stone is where the ball is hidden right there. For hole number five, we're going to head to the back left of where the hole actually is. So right here on the left hand side, you'll see there's a stone behind the stone is where the ball is. Go ahead and pick it up right there. For the next course, the ball is actually right next to you on your left from the start, right next to that stone there. So just turn around and look past the current stones to find it. For hole seven, the ball can be found in the middle past this broken pillar piece right over here. Fits in quite easily if you're not looking or paying enough attention, but it's right there. For hole number eight, you're going to go progress along this pathway over here. You'll see there is a pillar on the left here. Now you're going to just walk around this pillar and you'll see the ball is right next to it. Speaking about pillars, we're going to go to the next pillar as well. The one at the very far end, right next to the hole over here. You'll see the balls next to the pillar here too. For hole 10, you're going to go all the way across the course over here, past the hole. You'll see there's a little half wall. You're going to go ahead and look over this wall. You'll see right next to this plant, the ball is right there. Just go ahead and grab it. For hole 11, you're going to go progress to the platform where the hole is, right? And then just past it, right down the stairs here on the right hand side, you'll see it's hidden right there. Very nice and sneaky at the corner there. For hole number 12, you'll find this one on the right hand side. So as you go down to this platform over here, you're going to turn to the right, turn again. And if you look down here, you'll see a broken pillar with the ball next to it. For hole number 13, you're going to progress down this little slope over here. You'll see there's this big boulder of rocks on your left. You'll see there the ball is basically right next to them. So just go ahead and pick it up as you're walking down. For hole number 14, this one is really sneaky. You're going to walk down here, stick to the left, go around like this. And you'll see here we're going to go left again. And if you look over there, you'll see that the ball is hidden in the distance down there on the grass next to the rocks. For hole number 15, this one is actually in the dead center of the middle of the course by those rocks right in the center here. So you see this big central like rock area. The ball is right here. You can go ahead and pick it up right there. For hole number 16, we're going to progress to the back right of the course here. Just beyond this little rock over here, you'll see that the ball is right there just waiting for you to pick it up. It looks kind of like a moon right, or something. For hole number 17, we're going to walk past the hole and onto the, the pillar that's right there or like, you know, rock thing, I guess. And right next to it, uh, closest to the cliff is where the ball is. For hole number 18, for the final lost ball of this course, you're going to go ahead to this current stone and this plant that's right here in front of you as you descend the stairs. And you'll see the ball is right behind the plant waiting for you to pick it up just like this. And that is the final one. Now to see all of them, this is what every single ball from this course looks like. So if you're looking for a specific one, I hope this image gives you an indication of like, you know, which one you like, which one you don't. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks so much for watching.